Okay, so this is an encouraging start that I can get the majority of the box in camera at once. This is the Batman with um Edward Cullen. I don't know the name of the actor offhand. I should know the name of the actor. If I remember that sometime, I'll remember to mention it again. But this is um the Batcave. The the Batcave, the Riddler face off. And I got it on discount. And we're going to build it. But this is a 581 piece uh, set. So I'm going to film this in about 20 minute chunks. I have the alarm set already for the uh, timer set for this video ready. And when it goes off, I'll finish off whatever page I'm on. And I'll put the box in front of the camera. And you know, I'll say cut. And then yeah. So let's, let's go ahead and, and, and get... <sighs> Get into it. I am hoping. Ooh, it's got the uh, it's got the holes on the side, and we can see on the back here that uh, this is the way the model is going to look in the end. We got all the cool control panels and displays, and a uh, little um, note from the Riddler and just different stuff. We can slide the uh, thing back and forth. There's a cage for the Riddler. Bunch of cool stuff in there. I'm hoping. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh, look at all this stuff. Oh, we've got stickers even. Oh my goodness. Let's put those over there and... We can look through the instruction booklet here. This is a really thick, strong book. That is a... Wow. So, oh, so the, uh, the, the bags are numbered by the steps. So that's going to come in handy. It comes with a part separator. That's neat. And, uh, yeah, it's, it's, it's one, two, three, four, five. So I got bag number one here. Come on, get out. Uh. You can tell we're already going to have fun with this, aren't we? Um, I'm not going to unwrap the cape. I'm just going to stick that off the side. Here is the cool little part separator. There's a bunch of different tools built into this one little thing here, but we're gonna put that over there also. Okay. So we've got the um, head right here, and we can put his bat cowl on, and there's a, oh, okay, so I see how they did this. That is interesting. Uh, where is a hairpiece? Okay, so the hairpiece is in that other bag there. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. You guys gotta make it difficult, don't you? Okay. So, there's his regular outfit. Here's his bat suit. Here he is wearing the bat. So, they got the bat, the, they got the band around the eyes there. So, when he puts on the uh, helmet, his eyes white out. But then when he puts on the hair piece, and we'll see that in a minute, that is cool. Put that over there. Organize these parts up. There's the uh, motorcycle helmet. We'll look at that in a second. So take the helmet off and we can put the hair on 
And it still makes like a white stripe. That is um unfortunate. Okay. Oh, okay, so we have two heads. We have another head here that we could use. So I'm going to stick that there. And that's meant... To, oh, okay, no, I see. Okay, so here's that helmet I mentioned earlier. That's a cool-looking helmet. That's how that works. Can you see that? There we go. When he's got the motorcycle helmet on, it's like that. Then you can put that on and look like that with his eyes whited out. There is a, ooh, here we go. There is this piece here that I can stick in there like that. And then we're going to put that back down there. So we're going to start with a couple. This is an interesting piece here. And they also want me to find a 2x4 gray right here. <clears throat> and do like that. And then we need a 2x2 two two black piece like that. And this little cool bucket piece here. I think we're fixing to build like a motorcycle or something. If this part comes in in under 20 minutes, I'm just going to stop building and, 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 and call that part one. Okay, so this is going to be frontwards. And now I've got to do some interesting stuff here. Let's see here. Oh, here we go. Here, I was starting to get a little worried. Um, I can stick these on either side like this. Can you please come on? And then put the grill pieces like that. And there's some bracket pieces in here. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Put those like that. And then this other one goes over here. And, ooh. We got those little clip pieces to clip that in like that. And it wants another one. Where's the other one? It's right there. No, it's right there. No, where is this? There it is. I see it. Let me, um, come on. Ooh, you, you do not want to work, do you? <clears throat> okay. There's one tire there, and I lost the piece. Here's the piece. There we go. That looks like an interesting piece. Here we go. This and this are going to go up here in the front. See, this is a little little one by one piece with a little side stud on it. That is interesting. I like that. And then we need those one by one round studs. The uh, coloring on the, these pieces is very unique. I've never seen this. This is like kind of a silvery gunmetal gray almost. I like that. That is really, that is interesting. Ooh, a one by, a, a two by one, two, two by, here we go, this piece. Okay. And then a two by two. Like that. Yes, we are. We are building. We are definitely making some type of motorcycle 
vroom vroom car thingy. Ay, 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 stop fighting with me. Newton, you bastard. Okay, hold on, hold on. I need this piece, and it's showing me to hinge it like this. But then, here we go. This two by one with the little stud in the middle. And uh, is that what they want me to use? No, if there's a, uh, here we go, here we go, here we go. This must be like the clear console display thing on, on the motorcycle. There's this. And then I um I missed a step, didn't I? Yes I did. I very much so missed a step. I just completely jumped over that one. I don't know why. <laughs> Interesting. And then... wonder how many of you are screaming at me. Why did you skip that step? Now we can get back on. It's asking for a one by two with the stud in the middle. Dude. Okay, we're going to take that gray piece there. And then, okay, I'm just skipping all kinds of steps here, aren't I? Because this one is supposed to go up there like that. Okay, that's the back end of the motorcycle, though. That's cool. And then I can take this little one by one with a clip in it. And um, there's handlebars around here. Put together another wheel. Here, geesh, wow. Then take Okay, it's facing me like this. I'm gonna stick that one in there. And I'm gonna stick that one in there. And we've already gotten our tires done. Uh, does it matter which direction? I'm gonna put the um the hub towards that side. I just think it'll look better that way. And then, come on. There we go. Come on. Come on. There. Oh. And now we have his motorcycle. Uh, which body do I want to use? I will take his head off. And I will stick that over there. And then I'm going to take this. Put that on there, and then this is what this is intended for. You stick that on there, and then you can stick the back cowl on there. Now he's got like the the body there for display.
And they don't really have a molded seat for him. He's just got the uh, the brown there for him to sit on. I like that. That looks very, very good. Ah, let's see what's going on on the next page. Oh, wow. Okay. Okay. No, 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 no. This is going to be interesting. This is going to be kind of fun. You. Come on. Okay. So, this piece, and then that part there, and I need to get this piece here. And where's a vent? Here we go. We need this little vent piece here. And again, neat little, like, gunmetal silver thing going on. Um, do I want to do this? Yes, I do. And where's that other one? Wait, hold on. No, not that piece. I'm going to take this piece and stick it there. And then that piece and put it there. And now we got to go to the next page. This is, um, I'm pretty sure we're building, like, the primary control console. Which is going to be, this is going to be a really good, fun one to build, actually. And we're going to put these here. Give me a minute. There we go. And uh, that's going to go, I'm pretty sure that's going to go there eventually. But I'm going to not break the Lego piece. Oh, come on. Okay, well, let's just hope that that belongs there. This goes there. This other great clear piece goes there. And, oh, I forgot to um put these on. So these. And then these over here also. I'm pretty sure these work with part of the groove system on the uh, the back cave. These things, these weird pylon looking things, you could probably uh, clip things on there out there uh, at that part right there, but probably not further down on the, uh, yeah, that's interesting. And then one spot away, they want you to put like that. And then that. Oh, no. Oh. I was kind of correct. I still messed up on that. Need some one by three thin pieces. And then they want you to put this entire thing on top but like shift it backwards a little bit you see now let me bring in this thing and that is how you use that This is a good piece, the little chair piece. I like the little chair piece. And now we can stick it back where it belongs. Okay. I'm going to take this. And we're going to take these pieces that we've seen elsewhere before. These uh, <coughs> one by twos. But then they have like a slanted part on the front. That is interesting. I like that. <clears throat> and then this goes there. I'm not sure what for. And I'm going to take this. <sighs> oh, there she is. Okay. So, now time for stickers. Come in here with my exacto blade and gently peel that off. I'm gonna kind of stick it on there a little bit like that. Okay, now this is supposed to be like a keyboard, so I'm gonna put the space button. Let's 
on the bottom. Okay, so I have it slightly off, but that, come on, that. I like that. That is nice and straight right there. I think his intro key is upside down. Should an intro key be, a, be an L going the other direction? It hits Batman. He can have his inner key however he wants. Okay. You can go there. You can come here. And I can do that. And then we can put... These, I like the, oh, 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 I can see me using these hinge pieces on a lot of stuff. Hinge pieces are fun. I've seen people do, like, transformers with the hinge pieces. Okay, so, we're not going to use this part here. Wow, there's, like, almost a metallic shimmer to this plastic. That is, is that, is this special black or, wow, that's neat. Okay, so, like this. I'm going to um, wait a moment on the stickers. Then we're going to come up here and put these and these. And then we need some of those 1x4 grays. Yeah. If this video goes past, uh, we're already past 20 minutes. But uh, I'm going to go ahead and finish up the bag. Because we've got not too many more pieces to go through here. So these come in here like this. And like this. And then we're going to take some more of these hinge pieces. I'm just going to straighten the whole thing out for this. And then bring it back in. Um, okay, that that is interesting. They want these like that and that. Oh, that goes over there, and this one goes in the middle here. And I'm not going to jump the gun, but I think these uh, blue light bar pieces... Oh, you can't see the pieces. This entire time you couldn't see the pieces. I am sorry about that. I will hope to rectivate that in the next... Oh, my goodness. We can't see the pieces. So, these light bars go up here. And then these... Black pieces that are smooth on top are going to get mounted along the top here. There we go. I already got some weird scratches on these pieces, but it's alright. We're going to be putting stickers over them in a moment. And uh, we got here... A little claw hook thing and this goes there and that's going to peg on there and uh, can put that there and it seems like construction wise we're done we just need to go back in and do some stickers so let me get my sticker sheet and my exacto knife back over here so first, let's go ahead and start off with the small ones. Oh, there goes the alarm. It's all right. We, uh, I'm gonna finish up, and then I'll, I'll. So let's. Hmm. There we go. Gently. I want to uh, put it right there. And then I can there we go. Now let's get the next one on there. There we 
we go. I know I'm skipping around, but I don't think it particularly, there we go, matters. Okay. And, um, let's go ahead and take the magnifying glass real quick. And I don't know if you can see on the camera. No, you can't really make it out. But, like, as you take the little red thing and you put it across here, you can see the blue lines separated out. And you can see, ooh, that's a picture of Nigma. And then, let's put that over there. And, um, this is some type of question mark symbol underneath. And then we can take this one and we'll peg that over there for right now. And, um, I'm, oh, I'm to the Batman. You gotta, you can't really see it on the camera, but when you put the magnifying glass over it, that's how it works. So, continuing on, let's go ahead and put that there. Now, they want the, uh, this big one right in the middle so we're gonna peel that off and i'm gonna stick it on there and let's come on there we go look at that right macker in the middle Okay. This one, I don't think it really matters. Well, I could move the pieces around, so no, it doesn't matter. But I'm going to take that one. And this one's cool. So this one's got Edward Nigma in the middle of the screen and like some little tax spec details on the side, and he looks all angry. And this one seems to be like general information about the Batcave and Batman's equipment. Okay, you know what? That one ended up being slightly... <clears throat> I was trying to match it off the line here, and it ended up being just a little bit lower, but that's not it's all right. It's okay. It's good. I'm going to take that one. Do it like that. Um, Actually, I'm going to take that off there, and I'm going to do it like this. I'm gonna take this whole thing and then I'm gonna be quiet and careful as I do it so that I get it on there nice and straight. Ooh, that that doesn't look pretty good. I'm, I'm, I'm kind of part of that actually. Okay. And then we're going to take the entire thing and stick it back in here like this. And then we can take the Batman suit and stick it right there. And we got, we got Bruce Wayne on the Batmobile. We got his head in his seat. And we got some extra bits and pieces here. So we have... Two batter rings. So I'm going to go ahead and. Come on. Hold the batter ring. Like that. And I'm going to. Put that there. Out of the way. And drop Batman on top of Bruce Wayne. And I've got these pieces here. I'm going to. Stick a random piece there, and a random piece there, and just because. Okay, so this piece here likes to pop off really easy. That's something that they kind of should have thought out a little bit better. But hey, here we go. It's, it's done. Thank you for hanging out this long. So we've got the uh, the, the bat cycle. Well, I don't know if this is the bat cycle. It's probably just like a regular like kind of 
Harley Davidson kind of Bart motorcycle, and we've got the, uh, the these things on the side that can hinge back and forth. They're supposed to be the exhaust pipes, but if you want to, you can stick little peg things in there and build using those things. So those are nice pieces. And we have the back pewter. There's nothing on the back here. It's very plain, very bland. I like the use of the clear pieces to help support everything up. That's very, very nice. And we've got a chair here in the middle. We've got the Batman outfit here. We've got all the control consoles back there. There's a cup of coffee. Never keep your cup of coffee next to your keyboard. You should know better, Bruce. All right. So I'm going to stop building for now. And I'm going to go ahead and 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 and. So this has been part one of Colwyn Builds. This is the uh, the Batman Batcave the Riddler face off, and um, part two as soon as I get going on it. So thank you for watching.